update for you on the Junction City water crisis. KSNT News reporter Katie Garceron spoke with people in the community to see how they're holding up. We are going on day three after the storm and places in Junction City are still without water. Many of the people I ran into today said that their water was turned on very early this morning, but some of them said that they know people on the west side of town who are still without access to water. People having to go to stores to get their water, some stores even selling out of it. One woman I spoke to said she got the last pack in the store. Quinton Call is a father of seven who was without power and water for a day and a half. Well, we had to go get buckets of water from the neighboring town, Milford, Kansas, to flush toilets. It's the small things you take for granted. You know, I mean, it was definitely an ordeal. The city says that water continues to enter the system and that their tank on Spruce Street is slowly filling up. And as of right now, the city wants to remind its citizens that they are still under a boil water advisory and will continue to be in one for the next two to three days. In Junction City, covering local news that matters, I'm Katie Garceron, KSNT News.